Luke, Skybet, League 2 Player of the Month for August. How does that feel? Yeah, I'm delighted. Um, this is something I've never achieved before and um, yeah, I'm glad to, to be able to, to get it this month. Do individual awards mean a great deal to you? I know ultimately it's all about team success, but are these little things that you like picking up? No, definitely. It's obviously a good bonus to have, especially when the team's doing so well. It's nice to have the recognition on the side and yeah, and um, yeah, obviously it's a good thing to get in the end. Exactly what you want in terms of starting the season in form like this. What do you put it down to personally? Your your form at the start of the season. I think it's just confidence building from last year having the momentum um, to take into this season and then um, obviously the players around me have helped massively as well. And in terms of you in front of goal, a couple of seasons before you, you've had to wait for that first goal or then wait for a run to, to come, how much confidence does it give you to get off the mark nice and early and then build, be able to build from it? Yeah, it's huge. It's something that everyone looks for. You want to get off the mark as soon as possible and I'm, I'm glad I did that in the first game and it just... Give, takes a bit of stress off your shoulders and a bit of pressure off and it just lets you enjoy your football a lot more and um, yeah and obviously I've got five already this season and it's um, been a good start and it just motivates me more to, to keep getting more goals. And the assists as well coming? Yeah, got obviously got a couple as well and then um, obviously we've got players in the team that finish the chances and obviously with Sharpie, Irons and, and Gibbo up there it's huge um, to get as many assists as possible. I'm sure it helps when the whole team's playing with it's the confidence that everybody's got at the minute. Yeah, definitely. We uh, we score a lot of goals as a team, and it helps obviously them attacking players to to get them sort of stats. And obviously, like you said, the, the confidence that we've got because we've got the team is at the moment is uh, is huge. And um, yeah, we just want to keep it up. Obviously, at the moment, being top of the league is is a good thing but it's obviously early days and we just want to keep that going We saw last season in terms of the, the relationships you were able to build down that right side but you took that on another level this year with the relationship across the, the front line with players that have come in Jordan Gibson you obviously had it with Joanne's side anyway but Billy Sharp as well how, how much has that been you know, a real confidence boost to, to, to click so early with, with the likes of those players Yeah it's huge obviously we had a, we had a good pre-season together and um, it's, a, the, it's the good players to be able to just click straight away, it's the easy players to click with and you know what Sharpie wants, I obviously already know what Irons wanted when, when I played with him and then obviously with Gibbo, a similar player to me, I feel like he likes to come inside and I just know when he does come inside to make that run for to get in behind and um, yeah it's just cl click quite quick and um, hopefully we can keep getting them combinations together. Yeah, when he's laying on opportunities for you like that pass at Port yeah. Vale, can't, can't really Yeah, definitely, it. obviously. Same with Sharpie as well with the first goal. It's both great balls from both of them. It's just that connection that we've got already. The gaffer in, in press this week has is, is discussed the kind of work that you've done and the work that he's done with you and, and talked about things like making more unselfish runs and things like that. What can you, what insight can you give us into, into that sort of work? Yeah, it's just basically he said that I'm going to get... His, plenty of goals I'll get 15 20 goals just from running behind he he knows that and it's just it, it's it's shown it from from the games and um when I stay wide obviously I like to stay wide and get on the ball and try and take players on but then runs in behind the, are the are the balls and the runs that are, are going to get me goals and he's been putting that on me a lot and he puts it on obviously Gibbo as well and um yeah, it's been huge for me. It's, um, you see the impact that it's made for me as a player, and um, yeah, it's just I've, I've enjoyed it as well. You mentioned 15, 20 goals there. Have you got any? Can you tell us anything about the goals that you've got for yourself this season? Um, yeah, I've said it a few times. I've my aim is to get thirty goals and assists um, in all comps, and um, yeah, whether that's 20 goals or 15 or whatever, as long as I get to that 30 mark for goals and assists, I'll be happy. And then we just take it from there. Once I get hit that mark, we'll just make a new a new uh, target after that. So, yeah. Not a bad start then from the first month of the season. Yeah, I've got seven, seven so far. So um, it's good to, to get them in early and just to carry that form on. Well, just looking when preparing to, to speak to you, that you've now, well, Saturday's game against Gillingham, that took you beyond the, the amount of games that you've played for, for any other club. You've played one more for Rovers than, than any other club in your career. Does it feel like home, Doncaster? Yeah, definitely. I actually didn't realise that start. I didn't know that. But, um, yeah, it, it does feel like home. I'm 
very comfortable here. I've um, obviously that was one of the big reasons why I wanted to resign, and um, I've just enjoyed my time, especially the last year and a half. And um, it's just from the end of last season, it just shows why this club can be, and I wanted to be a part of that. It just feels like everything has. Been, you've been able to continue everything, both personally and as a team, from the end of last season, and, and only add to that with, with the start. Yeah, it just feels like everything's just grown, like the club's just grown gradually, and I feel like everyone wants to get the club back to where it was, and um, you feel like you can see that it's going in the right direction at the moment, and hopefully we can carry that on. You've had some great runs of form personally in in your career. Where does this this last few weeks rank in terms of what you've been able to produce? Yeah, it's definitely up there. I feel like obviously that second half of last season was obviously one of my best, and um, to carry that on into this season as well has been has been massive. And yeah, I'm just obviously enjoying my football, and that's all you can ask for, really.